stickers, dog. Look at your legs. This is my first time in the lighting room. Look at this. Crow, don't touch. $4,300. What do you do with this? Do it's like a table. This? Table what? White plastic. What shitting table. A shitting table? What did you say? <laughs> you are kind of glowy. I'm kind of glowy? Yeah. You're very glowy and shiny. How are my teeth? White? Yes, very white. There's a lot of lights. Can we get you? Fairfax, this used to be our old hood. Crow, that could be your school. This is where me and Daddy used to live. There? Well, over here. That's my school? Well, no, it could have been if we moved back here. We have to move back here. Blue's very excited because he's a sound guy and he just got new sound toys. Blue's got a gimpy knee right now. We came in here for lights and we left with a lot more than just lights. Let's go play with it all. How complicated do you think this is going to be? I mean, how hard could it be? They're lights, right? You know, there are instructions in there. Because I know how much you love instructions. I just don't see the point of using instructions. And how many times has that gotten you into trouble? In trouble? Well, have you? Yeah. Never. See? It's exactly as I would have done. <laughs> we it up. This may be a new apocalyptic modern fashion trend. I mean, this is what something that Katy Perry and Lady Gaga would wear and think they're so cool. <laughs> yeah. We got them all set up. There's a lot of trash everywhere. It's not trash. It's recycle. So much recycle mess. You ready? Yeah, turn these on. See if it works. See if we were actually successful in putting these together. Here comes the sun. Ooh, so fancy. Here comes the sun. And I say, let there be light. I can't even see you now. There he is. He emerges from the dark. That is bright. Look, we're lit. L-I-T. It's lit. So before would we shoot, sometimes it would look like this and we'd use no lights. It was fine. Whenever we had this ring light, it'd be like this. But it'd be really harsh and only from one direction. So you'd get shadows and it just was not like very unfilled and didn't look so great either. But now we've added these two soft boxes. A light on the right, a little light on the left. They're all filled with light. I mean, hopefully. I haven't really seen this yet, so. The intention is that we should look good right now. It's really bright. <laughs> I don't even know if we look that good right now. But you get the point. The point is that you have a light coming from all directions. So that it fills everything out, it softens, and it makes you look nicer. Who's really anxious to get to the next part? To open up our next toy that we bought today. This is the one that I think he was most excited about. Although you should save this for last. You should be talking about our other things we got uh, today. Fine. Today we also, this I'm surprised you're not more excited for. It. We also bought us some new uh, sound um, equipment. Talk, talk, talk. And how do you feel about the weather today, Mr. Dallas? No, no comment from Mr. Dallas. The thing with these are though, you have to be a team. What's your favorite color? I'm going to Colorado in a few. And <laughs> Friends of ours introduced us to this particular piece of equipment. For the sake of not copying them, we're not going to mention their names. I mean, you can see in our video. The Phantom 4 Pro. So pretty. Basically, Mark and Ethan, we 
copies you. I'm gonna take this to Colorado and uh, get some shots of my homeland and make you guys a little video. We have to register this and get it all set up before. So could you work on that tonight? It's fun for you, right? Sure, Blue. I'll stay at home and register this drone and get it all set up while you go to the show pro concert. And I wish we could take, take it out and test it and show it to you guys, but I mean, that would be like the actual appropriate thing ah, to do for videos like this. That. We should be showing you how these mics work, how this drone works. That would require us to know how they work. Yeah. So and that's how like most YouTubers would do this. But we are not most YouTubers. We also have this box. What? Which we can't open right now because it's Matt's Father's Day present. You think he's so good at hiding this from me? <laughs> so speaking of Father's Day, we teamed up with this really cool company. That's actually a really great Father's Day uh, gift idea. If you guys are like looking for a last minute Father's Day gift, this is pretty cool. It's called StoryWorth. Basically, the concept is is you give you can give it as a gift to somebody mm -hmm. and. They, would you ask them questions? Yes, it's subscription. Questions get emailed to whoever you choose. So if I chose my dad, uh, he would receive emails, questions, prompting him to tell a story or answer questions, whatever. You, you can personalize it. But over the course of a year, all of these stories get combined. And at the end of a year, these stories are bound into a hardback book up to 480 pages. I think it's a really great idea. I mean, for Crow, he'll know things about his grandpa that he might not ever think to Ask. And when my dad has passed and Crow's an adult, he can pass it down. And it's just a cool book that you have as a keepsake in your family. But if your dad or whoever you give this to is not so tech savvy, they don't necessarily have to email it. They can just call and also tell the story. So if you're loving this idea and you want to give it to as a gift to your father or just anybody else that you think would really love this and appreciate it, then you should go to storyworth.com slash Blue. The link is in the description and you get 20 bucks off because that's how we do it. I hope you enjoyed this uh, this video uh, of our tech savviness. Tech call. Tech savvy. Is the word.